What is happening now? Welcome back. So I checked the, uh, the other episode. I think that actually sounded really good. Um, so hopefully you all agree. At its peak, bullets the king in the distance. But look, I refuse to believe. That's a uh, what's his face? Lost boy. Strava. Which apparently I can kill him and get a cool... Uh, there's a thing called Talisman of Beasts. I remember because I used it on my strength build. It's basically like your... Your uber catalyst that uh, can do well, it has it has pretty good magic ad adjust, and more importantly, you can use both miracles and spells with it. Um, but I'm not sure if I'm gonna get it. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh god! Just scoop me up and get me out of here. <laughs> that was a rather disappointing fall. Uh, so I've taken off almost everything. I am down to where's my weight? Where's my weight? Equi or item burden. 38 out of 96. So we're looking good now. Um, I do think I'm going to stick with this, though. So there are way, way less magic catalysts in this game than I was aware of. Um, essentially, we have the, the wooden one that I, I have on right now. And then uh, we have the silver one that I started with. And then the insanity catalyst, which is your, uh, you know, double the cost of spells, but uh, make them hit twice as hard type thing. Or 50% more or whatever it is. Um, I'm probably just going to stick with wooden. Silver gives me more MP, but I feel like my total MP hasn't been an issue at all, so I'm not sure if it's really justified getting the MP. Um, wooden has slightly stronger damage than it. Insanity obviously has higher damage than both, but I don't want to cut my MP in half, uh, so I think I'll probably stick with wooden unless I go through and get Talisman of Beasts, which involves... Uh, involves getting pure black and either killing Estrava or killing some other guy. I just, I don't know. I don't know if it's necessary. I think I could stick with the wooden. Uh, but spent most of my souls. I've upgraded this. Buck was up to plus five. I mean, this isn't a very uh, block-centric build. The only time I'll block something is like dogs, you know, just to, to block and counterattack. So sticking with the buckler is more than enough, in my opinion, to to get by doing that. I think we're coming up to a boss. Oh, this place. Yep. Yep. Fuck you, dude. I already know you. I already know what you're gonna do. Yeah, no. I'm not dying to your bullshit. Ow. Oh my god. Maybe I am. God, he hurts. That guy is, I remember him being rage inducing on in my first playthrough. Because you'd like come here and it's just boop, blows up. Oh, looks like you're dead, dummy. And the whole time he's like, Whoa, ha, 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 ha. and you're like, I'm gonna break your, your fucking jaw. Stop with your laughing. Is this the way to the boss? I know we have a boss coming up soon. Yeah, we're getting close to spider. Oh, shit. Remember, way back in the day, I, uh, this is a drunk through moment. We were at the spider, and the spider was. Th and this is back when drunk throughs were not even really drunk throughs, they were more like get trashed throughs. Um, and we were making our way to. The spider boss. No, this goes down. Um, but I could not beat the spider boss for the life of me. It was just absolutely destroying me. And so, uh, we, we put a pin in it, and then the next week, somebody made a, they made a bet on, like, how many times I was gonna die to the spider that week. And I was like, yo, 100 bucks as I do it first try. And I beat it first try. That was the start of me taking money from poor souls for being dope at souls. Ah, the crisp blade. This is, uh, if I remember, this does something good with magic. Yes, 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 yes. Okay, so it boosts my magic damage while it's in the offhand, but I will take more damage from magic attacks. That's definitely a good pick considering nothing wants to try to go toe-to-toe -to -toe with me, aside from those fat bastards with their fireballs. Um, so it came from there. Yeah, I think we're good. I think we're good now. 
And there's nothing else here, so... Let's go. Hey, I remember that Spire Fighter, though. Spire Fire. Fire Spider. That thing was, was ass. So, I mean, I think I was playing, like, some half-assed quality build. Well, no, I was doing, like, a faith quality. Because Drunk Throughs have always been a, uh, you know, halberd, miracle, shit like that. Um, and it, it was just, it was terrible. It was absolutely terrible. I got, like, pushed into a corner by him, and then he'd hit you with, uh, his, his, uh, webbing, basically. And you'd get slowed down to where you couldn't do anything. And it was terrible. And he's probably gonna kill me a bunch here, too. Oh, no, he already got me with the web. Shit. Yep, this is, this is what, this is what happened. This is what I remember. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, why am I using that? No, I don't need that. Ah, oh, shit. Did he get me? He did. Stop that. Ow. No, I need to move, dude. No. God, the webbing. Ow, the webbing hurts. Use the half moon grass. Oh, shit. I'm webbing myself up right now. God damn it. So all I can really do here is just kind of buy time. Yeah, that hurt. Uh, ow. How long do you do this for? I don't remember you well enough. Let's do a 102. What's Flame Toss doing? Probably not much. 84. Not the spell I wanted. No, not the demon. Don't not demons prank him. you can like lock his thing and then get some good damage in oh no I'm gonna die to this yeah all right that's okay that's okay so I think I'm trying to remember I think you can run behind him I kind of boned myself there at the start because I was like oh I'm just gonna run this way and it, it didn't work out well I think I'll be better off just getting up and giving him a whooping with the- oh my god. Why am I terrible at that jump? Give him a whooping with the, the falchion. Then I need to decide if I want to go for the fire bow. I mean, I know it's a really good weapon, but to be honest, I'm not sure if it's gonna be worth it. Like, in this particular case, you know, it's like... I already have ranged in the form of soul arrows. Yeah, I could snipe something that's slightly farther with the fire bow, but is that really needed? You know, like I just, I'm not sure I could see the benefit of it. If I was playing a strength build or a dex build, yeah, sure. Fireball, fire, yeah, fire bow all day. But with this build, I'm just not sure if it's really going to, to make or break anything. You know, I feel like I have already fulfilled, um, I've already fulfilled that category of stuff. <laughs> what you got for me, fatty? Full moon grass? So yeah, I'm just gonna run. I think what I ended up doing was I beat this thing using that crazy fire shield. I just like blocked everything. But I know one of the things you can do is where he like pulls his legs in and then does a horizontal sweep. I remember that you could block that and then uh, right after that get some damage in. And kind of as you saw in that fight, there were 
there were times where he would essentially like fall down and have a vulnerability phase. So what I might want to do actually... Actually, don't I have... Fuck, I should have put that skill on. I have a water veil or whatever. That would have shut down the fire damage very effectively. Um, what else could I use here? No, 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 no. Okay. So what might be the best strat here? Maybe I stay back. I stay back and I blast him with Solero, and then the second he's vulnerable, run up and falchion him down. Is there something like below? Nope, definitely nothing there. That is just a big hole. Let me get up to him first with the shield. Oh god. It, and then I gotta block it. Alright, now to stay down. Yes! Yeah, that's why he spazzes out and tries to slam. No, that's right. I think you can back up here and avoid it completely. Or maybe not. Maybe it's a... You know, he, like, torches the whole, the whole uh, tunnel with it. I can beat this race. Oh yeah! You hit me with fire, I'll hit you with magic. Armor spider down. You revived. All right, now let's get all the goodies that he had here. Uh, renowned soldier, soul. Spider stone. That's it for here. All right. Um, oh, no, you don't. Ages since I've leveled up, but to be fair, I like hauled ass through four one and got a ton of souls. So that's, <laughs> I mean that that's why that's the reason. Oh god, I forgot about those. I thought those were shinies. Forgot bomb carts. Um, I'm trying to remember if I can even. Go down here. I think there's loot if I make it all the way to the end of this. There's there's so 
something over here. I don't remember exactly. Oh, there's this asshole. So there's you. I can take this down, but there's, there's something else here. Ooh. Maybe this was where I... I don't know if maybe this is where I went to kill the guy that I got Talisman of Beasts from, but I, like, I vaguely remember fighting my way past all this bullshit. a drop down yeah I think you can actually drop down and survive that but I think you can approach it from a different angle as well so this is the one path I don't know if I want to go this way yet oh that's what it comes here oh man the worms Remember, one of these things, like, a thing pops out of it. Oh, that's right, and they do, uh... Okay, the worms do acid and it breaks your gear. It's all coming together again. It's all coming back. I get down there later. Big fat roly poly, but I th think you can, yeah. Here, I don't remember if you're supposed to drop down or if this is like the. Oh, yeah, you can drop down and it's a shortcut to get the loots. No, I think you have to. I don't see any other way to get this loot without dropping down. Hero souls. Thing is, I really gotta be careful here, because if I die, we are going towards black tendency. And I'm really not a fan of that. You know, really not trying to go to black tendency. A little bit closer here. I think you're supposed to fight this thing from the front, and if you do, it jumps down, but you can do this, and it just sits here like a good little piggy and lets you just beat it to death. Wait, I poisoned it? I don't know how. Looks like it's gonna blow up. Dragonstone. Flame resist. Was there something over there? Oh, there was. Oh, there's this. Oh, not today, asshole. So you go this way. I don't know. I don't really tr trust this rolling off. I feel like that'll get me killed. Um...
Hello. What's up, buddy? What are you doing here? You. What do you want, Patches? You. Yeah, I think I come out of there if I actually make my way how I'm supposed to. Right, 7, 112. That's a nice little boost. I would then make into oh no. I'm not behind you listen how about we just both calm down you stand there and feel the power of my cheese Resilient little fuckers. Judging from the design, I'm guessing it's like they're weak to blunt damage or something. Like big ass explosions. Lots of dragon stone. So if I want to go further from here, it's taking the post patches path, and that goes down, and you fight your way past more wormies and shit. Let's leave that. I wanna um, wanna try and work my way backwards because I've come a pretty pretty far distance. The last thing I want is to get murdered down here, and then I'm like, well. We're up Shit's Creek now. Okay, Poise Master. Damn. First split. These look like they explode if I get too close. I'm just gonna take that loot and be on my way. Definitely explode if you get too close. Oh shit. No, wait a minute. No? Oh. That that would be the obvious solution. I'm like, fuck, I'm stuck down here. Nope, just gotta turn around. Alright, that's the pit with the loot that I grabbed up earlier. Phantoms. That's right. Okay. 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 How do I, uh, uh here? Uh. <laughs> My idiot. What? 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 Are you both that stupid? <laughs> what the fuck? 
<laughs> they both killed themselves. Oh man. Uh, let me. <laughs> oh god, hang on. I'm gonna I'm gonna reload those lizards. But that that is wow. That is funny. Like I'm gonna get you once I find a way to get past this ledge. Okay, buddy. Oh, I remember this. This is the, the magical crystal lizard pit of goodies. couple times here got to get them lizards I'm sure as hell not running back here three times This is one of the few times that I wish I had a. Uh, wish I had like a hammer. Might be able to use the club that I picked up. Just something to like beat. Are the rest all up top? Hell. I gotta say, comparing, uh, oh shit. Where are we at? Fucking. Damn it. Let me drop the great axe for now. No! Oh, I'll be fine. Yeah, after this, we're definitely making a trip back to base. What do we got over here? Pure sharp stone. Yes. Yes, that is definitely something we want to keep. I mean, the axe is cool, but I'm not going to use the axe. Um, speaking of my, my difficulties, though, can I... Yeah, I can probably club them down. I'm guessing I cannot axe them down. I probably don't have the strength to use that even two-handed. Reload. I think I got all of the ones in the, the little crystal lizard cave. I like this crystal cavern a lot more than uh, Dark Souls for sure. One is filled with invisible drops you don't see. One is filled with crystal lizards that want to give you goodies. Right, this place is done. There should be the one down here that I let escape. This is where I came from, and if I remember, I should be able to take this back up, and it should lead me back to where I can teleport out of here, spend them souls, and deposit the uh, 50 kilograms of upgrade mats that I have acquired. Yes, just follow the cart. Looks like another lizard up there. Another lizard that I missed? 
Oh shit, it's running from the cart. Bold of you to assume that running will allow you to escape. Or Little do you know, I can manipulate the time-space continuum by reloading you to a previous state. Zawada! Actually, to be fair, this power is more in line with golden experience than the war, but you get the idea. Alright, well, armored spider down, buttload of crystal lizards down. I think we're at a good spot to stop. Um, so we'll probably just continue through Stonefang. Um, you know, I see no reason to to not do more of Stonefang. So let me uh grade you more. Might as well. I mean, what do I got to lose here? Nothing. Give me that. Yeah, give me that buckler. All right, so I'm going to deposit all my stuff you come back. and upgrade. Well, I'll There's upgrade while y'all are here because people are always like, what did you upgrade? I got to know. Probably going to take it up to 15. And all right, and that's it. We're going to take it up to 15, and that's it. So anyway, stay tuned. I'll catch y'all soon enough with